Good afternoon. This is Elliot Schlissel, the Father's Rights Lawyer. There was a recent case in Queens County where a wife had brought a divorce suit against her husband. She was successful in the divorce proceeding and the husband brought an appeal. The appellate division of the Second Department and Appeals Court reversed an order of the Judicial Hearing Officer. The case was then sent back for retrial on the issue of the husband's contributions to the marital estate. He had requested equitable distribution of the marital assets. The appellate division in its decision had said the Judicial Hearing Officer's decision was patently unfair to the husband. The wife's position in the second trial was basically the same as in the first. She presented legal arguments her husband should not receive equitable distribution of any of the marital assets. She claimed he was lazy, he did odd jobs. After the hearing, it was found that the wife was the moneyed spouse. She worked as a microbiologist and had substantial income. During the course of the marriage, the husband took care of the party's marital home. He also raised the party's son. He had found real estate to make investments in that benefited both of them. The judge on the case was Pam Jackman. Pam sits in Kings County, Brooklyn. The husband made significant non-economic contribution to the marital state in Pam's decision. She found that the parties had lived a lavish lifestyle. She found that the husband had promoted his wife's career. Judge Jackman went on to find in her decision the party's wealth and lifestyle related to the husband's insight with regard to lucrative buildings that they purchased and made significant profits on. She concluded the evidence supported the husband's request for 50% of the marital assets because of his ec economic contributions to investments in maintaining the child. My conclusion is stay-at-home dads can play important roles in their marriages. And this entitles them to equitable distribution of the party's marital assets. Thank you.